Hello, Otaku Fujoshi and the Anime Curious. My name is RandomSama613, and this is Anime Opinions. This week I decided to review a movie that's been out for a couple years, but I finally had a chance to watch it. It's First Squad, The Moment of Truth. It's done by Studio 4 Degrees C and Molot Production Studios. Uh, Studio 4 Degrees C is best known probably for the new Berserk movies that have been coming out. Uh, Molot Production Studios isn't really known for all that much. It's starting. First Squad set during World War II, and it follows a squad of soldiers who all have supernatural abilities. They're all either orphans or children who are requisitioned by the Soviet state. Uh, it was made up to combat the Nazi occult uh, equivalent. So this isn't exactly an original concept, but it was still fairly well executed. I'm just going to go straight into what I liked about the movie and what I didn't. Uh, first off, the characters that you actually get are good. They're really well done. They actually have, they're actually fleshed out. They do kind of tell you where at least the main character comes from. So she's not a complete mystery. The rest of her squad, they give you like some basic background about them. There's not a huge ton of explanation as to where they all come from. They all have different occult powers. Uh, so, you know, the characters are well done. At least you kind of, at least they're, they're relatable somewhat. And they're interesting to watch. The plot itself is actually fairly well done. It gets a little weird. It's a little hokey. Um, but it was still fairly well done. It wasn't awful. The battle scenes that they do do are well done. Uh, so it's, it's, it's fairly well done. It's not amazing, but it's, it's good. Uh, all along those lines, the animation is also very good, which can be a make or break for me. Uh, if, even if the animation is poor, if the story can carry it, it's fine, and vice versa to a certain extent. Uh, but in this case, both the story and the animation were fairly good, so they didn't lose me at that point. Uh, the dub is also okay, it's not great. I've heard a lot of better dubs for different movies, but it was still acceptable. As to the the cons of this, uh, the bad ends, uh, it was rushed. It was really, really rushed. It's only an hour long, and you can tell that it was kind of meant to be an hour and a half or two hours. It really wasn't a movie that should have been stuck into the one-hour pigeonhole that it was, because it, it felt like Order of the Phoenix did. It had a lot cut from some varying places, and it felt disjointed and weird. Like, they skipped some important plot points. I think if there's an extended cut of the movie, it would probably be a lot better. The other major issue that I have with this movie is there's no resolution at the end of it. They they do, they do go through the whole, the whole deal. I'm not going to tell you exactly what happened. But they resolve the issue, the immediate one, and they, they just kind of leave it. They don't, they don't deal with all the other things that they brought up throughout the entire movie. They just left it. And it felt incomplete. I'm hoping there's another movie or something, anything. Um, I have not found it. Uh, so it was just, it felt incomplete. Like they didn't finish it. That having been said, it was still good. I still sort of recommend it. It's only an hour, so you're not losing a ton of your time. And it's, it's still at least interesting to watch. And I thought that it was still fairly well done. It wasn't great. What did you guys think? Have you guys watched it already? Uh, if you have, go ahead and leave something in the comment section right down below. Um, I want to know what you guys think. Uh, legitimately, I actually want to know what you guys think. Because I thought it was well done, but I thought it could have been a lot better. Um, I will link in the description if I can find a place to watch it instantly. I did get it through Netflix DVDs because I couldn't find it anywhere else legally. But... Uh, in the meantime, I'm RandomSama613. This has been Anime Opinions, and until next time, watch more anime.